Does AD Does AD a bucket is Rashi? Yeah. Uh, Torah is commonly referred to as a project that takes about a year. But uh, more specifically, it takes about 1,800 hours. By the time a person finishes the writing and the uh, corrections that may be necessary to make and the sewing and the proofreading, say it's a project of about 1,800 to 2,000 hours. Oh, God's mysteries, why God decides who stays and who leaves. Okay. My name is Yehuda Klapman, and I was brought up in Brooklyn, and I presently reside in Crown Heights, which is a neighborhood, a Hasidic community in Brooklyn. And uh, I was fortunate to be able to be chosen to be able to write this Torah in memory of Rabbi Gansberg, who I knew since I was a little boy, when he used to come to speak a weekly Tvar Torah, a weekly uh, message from the Lubavitcher Rebbe, by coming to our synagogue in East Flatbush. And, uh, I say I know the family since I'm a little boy and actually grew up with the children. Okay, whoever's done writing, I'm going to say I'm interested in doing this type of work when I was about five years old. I went to the synagogue service with my father, and uh, one particular week they were rolling from the Torah reading of the previous Sabbath to the holiday reading of the day. And uh, my father was not one of the two people to actually roll the scroll, but he right away grabbed my hand and took me up to the Amut, the place where they were doing the Torah reading. And as the columns were whizzing by from one side of the scroll to the other, he showed me every one of these letters and every one of the... We will come return here, we will take out all the Torah scrolls and greet this Torah scroll as it joins a family of eternity, of immortality, of a Torah that was passed on to us generation to generation. But above all, this is a moment where we connect as souls. Okay. By the sons, only for the cameras, and sons-in-law of Rabbi Hirsch Gansberg. Um, as soon as we complete the Torah, there's going to be a Hagbeh, which will be done by Rabbi Moshe Lieberman, his oldest grandson. And then the Galila by um, Rabbi Moshe Gutlov. Lifting, lifting. That's the lifting of the Torah, as well as the wrapping of the Torah. And then we're going to be heading outside, as it is the custom by Jews that when we finish the Torah, it's a very, very big simcha, a very happy occasion, and we go out to the street, and we all, the entire congregation goes out, and we dance with the Torah in the streets, we'll be going around the block, we'll make a left turn on 118th Street, let's continue writing, this is the stuff. Speak louder, please. We'll be making a left turn on 118th Street, and onto Frederick Douglass Boulevard, to 119th Street, and back to the Chabad, we'll, we'll do Hakafot, when we come back to the synagogue, we will do the hakafot, eight hakafis, as it is not Simchas Torah today, but rather it is a completion of a Sefer Torah. So for that reason, we do it eight times to go around with a lot of singing and dancing. And after we complete that, it is very important that everybody have the opportunity to kiss the Torah, the mantle of the Torah. It's a very special moment. And uh, men, women, children, everybody should take the opportunity to make sure to kiss the Torah before it is returned into the ark. So just uh, stand by. So we're finishing up over here in a couple minutes. We'll be raising the Torah. And then we'll be joining the children who are waiting outside, ready for the parade, onto Manhattan Avenue. We're finishing the last letter now of the entire scroll. Being done by Beryl Gansberg, the Shai's younger brother. My dear brother. No, no, no. So that was just good. You don't sign your name. Somebody does not have it. Okay, now just touch up that elf again from the top of the video. See if it won't do that. Okay. Um, can I hear the corner? Mazel tov. Mazel Tov, Break a glass? You want to break a glass? Okay, good. Okay, just take a couple minutes to dry. The scribe announced that it'll take a few minutes to dry. But while the ink dries, 
and immortal from the beginning of time. This scroll here that we're about to conclude, as the ink dries, is exact, exactly the same Torah scroll that Moses wrote over 3,300 years ago. Word, letter by letter, exactly. So it's a great honor to be here. It's a very historical moment. This Torah scroll joins now thousands, hundreds of thousands. Mushka and all the other members of the family, many healthy years of building parliament to transforming it into a... Thanks for coming, Thanks for coming. When they come back, when they come back. Can we start the music?